during their record-breaking season. Yes, they did. They Fantastic were, game. I believe it was only the Timberwolves and the Celtics that won it at, at Oracle that season. Yeah. I mentioned how Steve Kerr in the show open, Steve Kerr mentioned how every team has a, a defensive stopper as Draymond Green gets that layup right there. Curry for Wiggins in the corner. Andrew attacking. And Andrew with the flush got Towns in the face as he went by. No whistle and go into a video game room and see Cat in there. And they will play video games together still. Says he's still very tight with Josh Okogie as well. Ricky Rubio. Be nice to see Ricky get his offense on track. D'Angelo Russell back in the mix. D'Angelo comes in the game so early. D'Angelo's almost like a starting point guard. He comes in so early in the first quarter. Wiggins drills a three. You don't, you don't win games by yourself. And Steph Curry is not a defender. And the, the best thing that this team does is defend is Bazemore gets a nice cutting layup from the right corner. Curry, more open of a look that time and a different result. Connects on his first three of the game. Foul on Draymond Green. Wolves work it out to Jaden McDaniels, and Jaden connects on his first triple of the game. The, the first make was a long two, but if they're going to be in the playing tournament, they would prefer to be the seven or eight seed, so they would only have to win once. As Carl Anthony Towns, he extends his streak of made threes. Back to Ricky, straightaway three. Towns comes up with a rebound. Edwards inside, and Ant has his first points of the game. Right to Anthony Edwards, who makes a tough inside hoop. And it's an 8-2 run by Minnesota. But the answer out of the corner by Andrew Wiggins. He's got 10 all of a sudden. D'Lo off the feet from Rubio. That was nice. And Steve Kerr wants to use the timeout. Obviously, they all admire Steph Curry and what he's been able to do. And it's, it's something that Steve Kerr, I think it's one of his better coaching jobs. You think of... Jordan McLaughlin as he knocks down that triple. What a beautiful shot that was. Timberwolves have not had the lead tonight. D'Angelo Russell trying to rectify that, and he does. Minnesota in front for the first time. Wow. Active and, and regular field goal percentage. Just a great shooting team over their run of games as Nas Reed just manhandling Toscano Anderson inside right there. Russell back to Aaron Gomez. Si, senor! Timberwolves on a 10-0 run. Reed, mm. beautifully executed, beautiful patience. Warriors still time to get off a shot. Had a career-high five blocks in the last meeting between these two teams. McLaughlin scoops it up and in. I love how V8 just plays with just tremendous energy and stays in front of people, and he takes on all these different matchups. And that will end the run by the Timberwolves as Looney gets hit as he puts it up and in. Or just dunk it. Absolutely. That'd be the more fun part. Andrew Wiggins knows a thing or two about dunking. McLaughlin and the Wolves turn it over again. Toscano Anderson races up the floor, and he's that time is able to finish. McDaniels and Anthony Edwards unable to catch that pass clean. The Warriors collect another turnover. It's the fifth of the game by Minnesota, and they turn it into a three. Job is to come off the bench and do just that. Edwards absorbs the contact, stays with it, and gets the finish. First meeting between these two. That was the game where Jarrett Culver originally injured his ankle as Ricky Rubio pulls the trigger. Towns behind the back. Rubio gets him a fancy dime. And, and I'm not a big college basketball fan, so I don't watch a lot of college basketball, and it's easy for me to miss that as Andrew Wiggins drains that corner three. He's having a whale of a game. By the way, he just won over 10,000 career points last week in the game at Ooh. Washington, and that one was impressive as Wiggins got up. Andrew. He also has a couple 16-assist game and a, and a tough couple 15-assist games. Towns drills the three. Sometimes they don't see that baseline double guy. The, the, the way that the Warriors just double team Towns is Curry. Curry can't get that to go. Oh, does yeah, he go. does. Creates some space <laughs> and gets a bounce. Unbelievable. Russell for Towns. Cat right down the middle. <laughs> right on Wiggs, too. Towns on the drive. 
And the Warriors come down with the rebound. Bazemore falls to the ground. Towns hadn't gotten up the floor yet, so he's going to get an easy bucket. Only in his rookie year did he shoot it accurately with less frequency. Rubio, meantime, is pulling off his best step Curry imitation. He's got five triples matching his season high. Nobody's back from Minnesota because everybody fell down again. Wiggins Towns fell the green. down. Yeah, yep. just... And it's a free bus basket for the Warriors, and Chris Finch will use a timeout. I gave you the KG, list of... KG, by the way. I we gave didn't you, say KG gave, the other night. Yes, we did. I did, too. Okay. I, I gave you 10 locks last game <laughs> against Houston. No, it was the uh, night before against well, Utah. Oh, it was against Utah. Yeah. Curry dumps mm. it off for Green. Oh, man. The, the, the synergy between Curry and, and Draymond Green is, is just tremendous. I love it. McDaniel's looking for his third three of the oh, night. No, Josh. Okoye comes up with the <laughs> offensive board. We gotta, we gotta look at that. I mean, that, that where Josh Okoye just came from. And then Towns draws the foul. Kent Bazemore that time was trying to get through that screen and probably would beat him through it. So, just excellent footwork. And Steph Curry, he's gonna knock that one down. You know that he came off that screen that time. We got a, all kinds of plays to look at here. And the Warriors track it down. Curry steps back for the three and drills mm. another. Curry getting to the rack. <laughs> There's the, the handle and layup. Baysmore. Timberwolves get a turnover. Edwards in the open floor. Has it poked away and somehow able to finish it anyway. Yeah, there you go. The speed of Anthony Edwards is, is he's like a locomotive. Curry, oh <laughs> my goodness, he is still ridiculous. That's what people came to see. 16 points in the quarter, pretty amazing. Edwards, able to kiss it off the glass and in. And a couple of them have been thrillers. Edwards, oh Jim Peterson, the bulldog and is the most dangerous on earth. Edwards now to double figures with 11. Wiggins trying to answer back, gets it to roll in, and Andrew's got 20. Reed. Get it to him. And step back for three, and Anthony Edwards has absolutely found his stroke. Edwards thought about it, steps back, will take it, and makes another. He's knocked down a couple threes, but it began with a fast break opportunity where he got a layup. Wiggins getting into the paint and gets a tough finish inside. And just to get out of the way, I got a big one on. I'm going to take him and I'm going to make a three-point shot. Anthony Edwards. Right in the face of Kevon. Take him out of the game right now. I know you want to come back with Carl Anthony Towns, but Nas is operating pretty well, and they're spacing on the floor, and Ant's getting off. and is doing his thing. Warriors. Forcing Carl Anthony Towns into the game. Warriors have Curry back on the floor. Curry pulls up, and Curry connects. Unbelievable. Wiggins. Got the screen from Dray Draymond with the spin, and we've seen Andrew with that spin be very effective many times in the past. Deserved to be celebrated because he was a, a very good player as Towns knocks down the triple. Wow. Back in a playoff hunt. Nice defensive play yeah. there by Draymond. Wiggins. Dishes it off. Mulder able to lay it in. Back to an eight-point game, three and a half to go. Right, and that's what I'm saying. And they, they've got two games against the Oklahoma City Thunder. They're gonna have they're gonna have a bunch of wins here, I think. Earlier this season became the Warriors all-time leader in career scoring. Mm, Anthony nice. Edwards. Four in a row. Four in a row. And the Timberwolves feeling good 